Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle pack. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle pack. Peter Piper picked a pack of pickle. Oh, I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm ready. I'm sorry. I'm actually really nervous because John is really a big deal. He's really famous. I have never been involved in something this big. I'm actually. I'm sweating a lot right now. I'm sweating. I'm very nervous. We're rolling. We're, ro we're, we're rolling. We're, we're rolling. We're rolling. We're rolling. Hi, I'm Susie Sunshine, and we're live in the beautiful downtown Clayton area where we're going to be talking to some of John's fans about his movies and what they think about what an amazing person John is. Let's go. I can't believe he didn't win an Oscar. Like, really funny, hilarious. Tom Cruise, George Clooney, Johnny Depp. Absolutely delightful. Charismatic, talented, and funny. Uh, adventurous, um, daring. That's so cool. Like he's been an astronaut, you know, he had to like save lives. The way that he plays so many different roles. Hey, what's up? Big fan. I would try so hard to play it cool. <laughs> Don't do that to me. Heart attack, heart attack. I was probably get real bug eye. Hello, and welcome to Meet My Entourage! The show where you get to know people around you just a little bit better. I'm your host, Mr. Coffee, and today we'll be learning about John's doctor, Dr. Renderson. And now for the question, which one of these places would Dr. Anderson most like to visit? Is it A, Antarctica? B, a pickle factory? C, Italy? Or D, Narnia? We'll be back after these short messages. Hi, I'm Barry, and I'm John's number one fan, and also the president of his fan club. And that's my assistant, Carrie. And as John's number one fan, I know everything there is to know about John. This is my box where I keep all the stuff that I've collected about John over the years. <laughs> oh, this is his sock. This is John's sock. Was actually on his foot. <laughs> and I also have John's used Kleenex. <laughs> I could probably sell this online for like a, a million dollars. <laughs> oh, and add can tell I'm John's number one fan. And if that stuff doesn't amaze you, you know what else I have? What do I have, Carrie? I have John's autograph, official. Carrie, give me. <laughs> See, I am John's number one fan. And, as John's number one fan and knowing everything about John, I know that John loves baseball. He loves baseball. So here are some important things you need to know about baseball. Harry will demonstrate. An important thing that you need to know about baseball is that you have to hit the ball. Well, that sounds a little violent. Uh, but I guess go ahead, Carrie. Hit it. Yeah! Yeah, get it again! Yeah! Hit it! Hit it. <laughs> nice shot, Carrie! Uh, 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 you will also need a glove! Uh, 
maybe try another color. And the last thing you need is a bat. Did, did, did you get that bat I asked for, Carrie? Uh. Oh! 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 Yes! Yeah, what the? Get the go! Oh! Another thing you need to know about baseball is something called a run home! what we're doing right now. Oh, uh, uh, don't forget, I'm John's number one fan! <laughs> Whoa, and we're back! I'm Mr. Coffee, and we're about to find out what place Dr. Anderson would most like to visit. To go over the answers, is it A, Antarctica, B, a pickle factory, C, Italy, or D, Narnia? <laughs> and the answer is Italy! Well, I'm about to head off to Italy with Dr. Anderson. I'll see you later! Bye! Coming soon to a theater near you. Mom, I'm home. Charlie was just a normal kid having a normal day. But when he sat down to do his homework... I wish I knew what you were thinking, because then I'd have the best story in the class. Little did he know his life was about to change forever. Whoa! A gift appeared to him out of nowhere that would give him a Whoa. great power. I wish you could help me find my ball, Charlie. What did you just say? I said, I wish you could help me find my ball, Charlie. Charlie could never go back to being just a normal kid again. Now he was... Top Dog! Go, Top Dog! To embark on adventures where no man has gone before, into the mind of man's best friend, and save the day! Thanks, Top Dog. You're the best.